What's up guys? I have another taste tester video for you today. Today we are going to be trying the new limited, for a limited time only, for the holidays, for Christmas, a Starbucks, um, what the fuck was this shit called? Uh, a, uh, Christmas tree frappuccino or I forgot what the hell it was called, but yeah, it's like a Christmas tree frappuccino or something or other. Um, as you can see, it's got some, uh, the, it's got a little strawberry, a little dried strawberry there as the, uh, topping, tree topping. Um, some green, uh, god damn, what the hell is in here? I'm just gonna go ahead and check my straw in there so it's not freaking in my way. Um... Let me see what the hell this was. I, I want I want to make sure I have the exact name correct. Hold on here. Starbucks. The Starbucks Christmas tree frappuccino. <laughs> Tastes like broken promises and thin mints. Is uh what this uh what. <laughs> But this one says, um, Washington Post says that. But uh, anyway, so it is the Christmas tree Frappuccino. Um, so it, most of it's brown. Um, and then you've got the the green on the top there with the uh, just strawberry there as the um, tea, tree topper and uh, some caramel whatnot there so uh here we go oh yeah you definitely taste thin mints that's for sure some andy's thin mints yep you definitely yeah definitely Yeah, you get like a real strong minty, thin minty taste. I guess it's mint and, well, it's mocha. So it's probably a mix of those two why you get that flavor. But it's pretty good. I like it. Taste it on my palate there. Anyways. So yeah, that's that's a pretty good drink. Um, I don't know if it will taste any different once I get to the green stuff there or not, but uh, otherwise, it's it's a pretty good drink. Um, if I were to compare it to the unicorn um, unicorn frappuccino from back in April, I think that was better. Um, I missed the Halloween one because they ran out of toppings or ran out of ingredients before I was able to try one. So that's why I um, had to, I think today is the second day of the drink. Um, it's available until the 11th. I will post this immediately. So, but anyways, this is a good drink. Um, I would probably give this drink a 7 out of 10. It's pretty good. And what's so kind of dumb about their drinks is that this is this is something that you could probably technically have any time of the year. You just got to know what the ingredients are and, and mix them together. But um, I like that Starbucks does these um, holiday-specific type frappuccinos. So not that the unicorn frappuccino was anything special holiday or anything like that, but... Um, it's pretty good. So I give that a 7 out of 10. If you like Frappuccinos, give it a try. If not, if you if you hate Starbucks, then you're probably not watching this video and you're probably not, uh, you're not going to try one, obviously. So anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more taste tester videos, more movie reviews, more video gameplay footage, and all that good shit. Later.